Welcome to an unboxing of a product that's actually phenomenally useful and popular, but maybe not as glamorous as, like, you know, the latest new video card or, you know, CPU or whatever else. This is the Blacks... Blackix? 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 I don't know. This is the Thermaltake This 5G. It's a hard drive docking station supporting 2.5 inch and 3.5 inch SATA hard drives. SATA up to SATA 3.0, that's SATA 3, 6 gigabit per second, with full support for USB 3 super speed. It carries a three year warranty and allows you to <clears throat> conveniently transfer large documents, pictures, or movies between hard drives and computers. Hard drive not included. Moving along. We've got a bunch of other stuff, which I don't think is really that interesting. And then over here, we've got a bunch of other stuff about how it's backwards compatible. It comes with a premium shielded USB 3 cable. Supports hard drives up to two, up to two terabytes. I don't know if that's going to fly a thermal take, although we have some three terabyte drives coming that we can, uh, we can check out soon. And maybe it's just one of those things where when the packaging was done, like two terabyte drives were as big as they got. You run into that a lot, actually, with NASs, where they'll say supports up to... 12 terabytes of storage when the reality of it is it was just because there wasn't anything bigger than you know a three terabyte drive when that NAS was uh, originally created. And something else will work just fine. So you actually get a fair amount of stuff. Oh, this is cool. Check this out. Let's find an SSD to like put it in. That's like so balling out. So you can be all like, Oh, it's smart. Look at this. Okay, so there's ventilation holes on the back, and then there's a label reader on the front, and when you have a hard drive as opposed to a, an SSD, the label positioning will be somewhat more favorable. Aha, here we go. Let's do a hard drive instead of an SSD. Okay. Do, 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 do. So you'll be able to see valuable information like the capacity. Bam. Just like that. Okay, so it comes to one of those for a two and a half inch, and it's also rubber and like, you know, shock resistant. Not that I'm gonna slam the drive too hard on the table. There, the SSD, shock resistant. And uh, comes with a sleeve for a three and a half inch drive, which also doubles as an oven mitt. Please do not use this item as an oven mitt. You know, disclaimer voice, right? Um, comes with a USB A to B cable. That's a USB 3 one, so you can see the extra pins there and the extra pins deeper inside there. Comes with a power adapter, doesn't come with an SSD or a hard drive, according to the box. Product warranty policy, okay, cool. Um, instructions, which is basically like connect the things and then plug the thing in and then like creating a partition, okay. And the black unit itself. So the reason we have one of these is because we have an upcoming video about UASP. So I don't know if you guys remember this, but ASUS current generation motherboards support UASP, which is an accelerated method of USB 3 transfer. So it's a different protocol than the standard USB 3 protocol that allows it to be faster. So we're going to take a high-end SSD, we're going to plug it into this enclosure, which uses USB 3 over UASP, and we're going to see just how much faster UASP is than the standard USB 3 transfer rates. So we're going to use the same ASUS motherboard to test both transfer speeds, and we are going to just turn UASP on and off in AI Suite in order to find the difference. So the unit itself is pretty straightforward. There's a like power button, it's a toggle switch, so you can conveniently easily tell if it's on or off. There's this guy, which basically is just allowing you to easily position a two and a half inch drive or you can take that out and I don't think I have any hard drives lying around actually. I've gone almost completely SSD in like every part of my life. So I, I no longer, um, yeah, I no longer believe in like three and a half inch hard drives. So uh, there you go. But if you had a hard drive, you would be able to plug it in here. I think that pretty much covers it. Thank you for checking out my unboxing and first look at the Black X 5G. Maybe someone can correct me on how to say that. I mean, you guys do love correcting me when I'm saying things, whether it's Processor or Asus. Incidentally, both of which are correct, especially Asus. But uh, don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, and other computer videos. So Slick was like, oh, I don't see the point of those rubber things, because anyone clumsy enough to, you know, bump their drive against something probably wouldn't bother to, like, put this thing on in the first place. So this is just a warning out there for everyone. If you need to keep your data, practice safe data storage. Use rubbers.